Hello ladies and gentlemen, it's Spoonie Pizzas here with another Pro Evolution Soccer 2019 video. Today I'm bringing you the best formation and tactics for Ajax. So you can see here it's a 4-5-1 with three attacking midfielders across here with Dolberg as an SS. So attacking instructions, counter attack, short pass, central attacking area, maintain formation, one for support range. We're going to be playing Tiki Taka style with the counter attack enabling your midfield to move and your wing backs to move forward very very quickly. Frontline pressure, middle aggressive, seven for defensive line, six for compactness, false number nine, tiki taka, and gegen press. Now this is a fluid formation, so this is without possession of the ball. With possession of the ball, the left back and right back become right wing forward and left wing forward, respectively. So they just push forward, and with that counter attacking style, that will help those move, uh, well, advance much quicker. Okay, so we're on legend difficulty. We're up against Tottenham Hotspur, and we're playing at Joh Johan Cruyff Arena. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more tactical videos. We've got plenty more coming up, so that's uh, that should be something to excite you. Uh, we've got uh, Tuchel's PSG tactics coming soon, as well as uh, Germany as well. So if there's any tactics I haven't done, let me know in the comments and I will get those done for you. Okay, so here we go. Now this formation can be used for any teams, and it's one of my favourite formations right now. If you like Tiki Taka style, then this is probably the best Tiki Taka formation that I've ever I've actually come across and created. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Away from this, Daily Blind. It's one of the worst defenders in the game, if not the worst. I thought it was uh, David Luiz, but he when I started playing as uh, Ajax and tested this formation, I realised it was more to do with Daily Blind being really, really poor. He really stood out and uh, using these. So many arrows and a good distribution, but anyone can pass it out from the back to be honest. And he's slow as well. Slow, can't defend, can't jump, can't header, <laughs> can't intercept passes. Defensively, atrocious. Poor positioning at times. Anyway, hopefully. With the Gagan press, he defend from the front, and he'll only have to deal with the long balls. Um, Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. So what him. do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to, to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Away from immediate danger. I have tried this with a possession um, style, and it's just nowhere near as good. Your players don't get forward quick enough. They just number four, and you just you need speed sometimes get your, to get your wide man forward. Now it's going to take its toll on your stamina, along with the Gagan press and the, the counter attack. Ah, oh, it's going to hold that. Spurs playing 5 3 2, making it very hard to get in behind them. Oh, come on, almost. Almost. Very, very close. To target, like the ball there. can't jump. Dyer Davis, I don't know why he's on the pitch to be honest. I'm sure they've got, I'm sure they got someone else who can come on and do a job defensively. Ali. Look at that, he wins the ball and then buggers off back into defense. No, mate. If you win the ball, you go forward. Real class. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Oh, yes. And it's Tadic. 
Okay, here we go. Good ball in. You see that Gagan presses. Stifling for Spurs. Try a rising shot here. Oh! Sloppy laps like that can do a lot of damage, but it was triggered by the closing down. Cool. Our players waiting for any rebounds as well. Played it short, chooses to go back. Taken short. Times and goes back. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's top defending and preventing him turning, Got which can open end. up many possibilities. Could be thinking about a shot here. Get that clear. Try and roll it. Oh, gosh. Too much power. Let's do it against the rising shot. I know he's got rising shots in him. Too much power there. Wanted to try and, as I was running across here, I was trying to draw uh, Danny Alley across number 20, because eventually closed him down. That's why I was moving across the box, but they pressed me from. In someone came out of, out of the penalty box to go and meet him. Oh, well played, David Blind. Criticised you quite a lot, but that was good. And this is Tadic. Tadic will try cutting inside here. Nice touch. Some skills there. Oh, brilliant block. All over Spurs here at the minute. Davis. Where the can attacks. There we go. That aggressive pressing. Getting impressed with so many men in the field. Spice lifting it over. Davis gets it away. Looks to clip it forward. Well played. He saw that coming. Tadic. And it's Tadic. Out to the left it goes. Zayak. Good save. God. Absolutely roasting Spurs. 70% possession, six shots through on target. Just the one from Spurs. And look at that. They only completed 24 passes. I completed 20, uh, 88. My word. <laughs> Almost eight times as many passes completed. Obviously, we're getting impressed. The players from 17th so minute will start to tie up. you going to get a feeling for how good this formation is. Imagine this formation with uh, someone sort of like Man City really would be He's absolutely devastating. Front, I'd probably go Hazus over a Barrett. Over to the left. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful ball in. He's in. Ah. Almost from Tadic. <laughs> oh, almost. Not Tadic. Uh, it's like. Out of the round. Deli Alley. Emerson. Point. Ericsson. Deli Alley. Lucas Mora. Davis. On the right now. What's on? This defense is, is weary of that opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight. Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. Oh, Blind. Oh. And he's on his way. Blind's always got a mistake in him. 
Let's go. Right. Good from Blend. Wins the ball, but just. Oh. He is dreadful. He's the only reason you'll ever concede uh, any goals. He's my reason, Maybe you guys can get him to defend better than I can, but Daily Blind is well, probably the worst defender in the game, I'm going to be honest. Vertonghen, no breakthrough and well into the second period, it is still nice. anyone's game. If you like that ticker type of style, then this is definitely it. Look at this. Oh, come on, can he score? Of course he can. Doberg. I normally play um, Neres in that position. Look at this. Players all over the place. Look at how many players have got in the box. Imagine Man City with all their all their players with the amount of control they've got. Deadlock broken. It's one nil. Look, you can't deny that it's a blow, but this game is far from unsalvageable. Ericsson plays it forward. Love this formation attack. This is beautiful. That pass the better. Really great. Spurs going a bit more attacking now. Going to leave some spaces. Also, he's very busy after trying to do some defending. There's <laughs> uh, Frankie. That's nice. Oh, how did you not get that? Rolling right towards him. Oh, that was great. With a human blockade, this is top defence. Oh, oh fullbacks are getting tired, mate. Right? Up and back with that counter. Counter attack on. Deli Ali. Song Hill Mid. Maturente. Little Flues, who's getting there? Keep going to make some subs. That's the job in a nutshell now. Let's hold up player by Doberg. That's the key of the, uh, the false number nine. A really good feat from him. Look at this. Look at this from formation. Ah. Too strong there. Ah. I gave up. I switched player thinking he wasn't going to get Ajax anywhere near that. To make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Just pulled Blind up just in time because I know in a foot race, even if it's against Levante, he is a sloth. Look at that, Laurenti's gonna so rip him a new one. Well, for me, this was the obvious Do you know what, my put Blind out on the and side. As a result of that, he was you can see it in the field. This is what he's replacing. The body becomes tired, the brain goes with it. And I think that's happened in this case. Freshen up a little bit. So I would normally play um, Neres in that SS role rather than Dolberg, but not a lot of people rate that Dolberg, but not for me personally. He's okay, but he's not, he's not as great as other than it's It's just not my suit to my style. Speed skills. Probably could have killed things off, but That's they should be okay. Look at that. He's got no stamina either. Keeper's got good distance on that. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. And it's Blint. Is it out of harm's way? Ajax certainly don't. 
need to overcommit now. Their priority lies further back. This has been so dominant. <laughs> now the breakaway. Oh. If this team could link up passes properly. You know, like I say, with a better team, better, better players on the ball. This would have been a cricket score. Let's have a look at the amount of possession and passes and everything I made, because that, that would give a real indication. Spurs remarkably better that second half. Not much, but 38% possession. They made uh, well, double the amount of passes they did in the first half. Um, and did a better job stifling me by pushing out a little bit higher. But they were playing 5 3 2, so it was difficult for both teams to, to get at each other. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. Give it a try. And yeah, let me know how you get on, guys. And uh, if you haven't already done so, uh, don't forget to hit that like button. That'd be a great help. Thank you very much. Bye bye.